Hey guys, this is Airsoft Review 23, and I am coming to you guys today with a review of the Spring MP5. Uh, before I start, I just want to say yes, this gun is spray painted gold. It did not come gold, as you see on some of the gun, it started coming off. Um, so yes, this is spray painted. It did not come this way. So uh, first off, I just want to uh, talk about the clip. Start with the easiest thing. The clip holds around, I'd say, 20-ish bullets. So uh, to load it in, what you gotta do is right here, there's a slide right here. All you gotta do is, oops, slide. Slide it all the way to the bottom. So now it's down here, it clips in. Uh, you fill the bullets right here, they go in really easy. Um, and then from that, what you do is stick it into the gun. Once it's stuck into the gun, on the bottom right here, there's a button. So on the bottom, you just click the button. Listen. And that releases the bolts to the top uh, to be able to fire. That's the clip. Alright, so now let's talk about the gun. Uh, to start off, let's go with the sights. The sights on the gun are pretty... Uh, crappy it's not well, actually they're not that bad but um they're clear you can see really clear on it just get a close-up of what the front sight looks like i don't know if you guys could see it but it's just a little circle with a hole and basically that is it for the sight so let's talk about the stock now the stock as you know is the back of the gun this stock is an adjustable two position stock. The first position is, as you see right here, closed. This uh, this is usually for a short game, um, for running into buildings and such. But also there's another one. If To adjust it, all you do is right here, this little button, you push it, and it comes right up. There's only one other position. And this is, as you see right here. It's a uh, long position for mostly uh, long shots for more accuracy. This is the stock of the gun. So this gun, along with pretty much all airsoft guns, comes with a safe and semi-automatic uh, switch. Uh, this one also has a full automatic, but it is spring. It just has it, I guess. I don't really know why. But for the first one, if it's all the way up to the top as it is now, it is on safe. As you see, I cannot pull the trigger. The second one is on semi-automatic. Push it down. Clicks on. And as you see now, I can pull the trigger. And the third one has an F for fully automatic. Um, but it's not fully automatic. It's a spring gun. So uh, they might just have it for a show, I'm not really sure. But this is a three switches, so we have safe, semi-automatic, and fully automatic, which does not work. This gun also comes with two strats for the sling. The first one is on the back, as you see right here. Can't really see it good on the camera, but it's just a little uh, clip right here from my finger. And then the second one is right on the barrel of the gun. Right there. I don't have a uh, sling to show you guys. But basically just clip it on to the back and clip it on to the front. And then you have your sling. Alright, to talk about how you load this gun. As I said, you put the clip in there. You click the button. And then to load it, this right here. You just pull it back and pull it forward. And then you have it. As again, you just pull it back. Wait for the click, release, and then fire. Alright guys, so that is the review of the Spring MP5. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button right up top. Right in this area, click guys, bring it to my page, subscribe, or just click the button right up there guys. It helps me out a lot, put a lot of time into my videos, editing and stuff. And I really only have 15 subscribers right now. So uh, just click the button up there. Subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.